Hey YouTube, Commander Tech here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to install and activate iOS 5 without actually activating it with the UDID developer's account. So if you haven't heard of iOS 5, iOS 5 was officially announced by Apple at WWDC last week. Uh, they released the beta for iOS 5, and here it is, you can do it without uh, using this method and paying someone five to ten dollars uh, for putting your UDID code into their developers account uh, but this is the method uh, to do it without a developers account uh, if you don't know about iOS 5 check out the video in the description below labeled iOS 5 it will tell you all the details about iOS 5 so what you're going to want to do first is Google search uh, iOS 5 download. Then you'll need to download the iOS 5 beta. Uh, just Google it. I'm sure you'll find it. Uh, then you'll have to download it to your computer. And I'll show you what to do next. Okay, so what you're going to want to do now is the shift restore. Uh, you, you might not see my cursor on the screen, uh, but hover over restore uh, press shift and click uh, so this would be where you downloaded your version of iOS 5 so you're just gonna click that open it click restore and uh, then it's just gonna extract the software and everything else this will take about two three minutes um, if you're gonna do this on an iPhone. I would put my UDID code onto a developer's account. Um, you can do that uh, through a friend. It's going to cost about five to ten bucks, but depends how good your friends with that developer. Or you can also Google search it and find someone to do it for five to ten bucks. So it's still preparing iPod for restore. This is going to take a little bit, uh, not very long. So I'm just going to let this do whatever it's doing right now, preparing iPod software and restoring and everything else. And I'll come back to you once it's done. Okay, Commander Tech, back here. Uh, hopefully that went well. Uh, you, If you followed all the steps, you would have done well. Uh, so now uh, I'll show you what you do if you did have the UDID developers thing, your number in the developers account. Uh, you can do this anyways, uh, just so you can hook uh, up to the internet. I'm just going to click the US. Uh, here Join you your choose network. your network. So there we go, it is joined. You'll be able to click next. So here is where it won't work. This is where you don't have your UDI, UDID code. Uh, so just try again or start over. If you press that, there you go, start over. Now what you're going to want to do, this is where the magic happens. Uh, let me just zoom in here. Triple click the home. And then now you have voice over. Uh, I don't think voiceover is on. There we go. Voice over on. Start over. So this may be a bit confusing. It's saying stuff and you're trying to do stuff. So now you're going to take three fingers and swipe down. And here you get the notification center over here. Uh, click the Yahoo icon right down there. And there you go. So you're brought up to Safari. Uh, okay, Safari. so now if you've finished all that, Find you out. can click Stop. voice over and it's off. Uh, so, whatever, go to mobile website. Not nah, sure, uh, but this is it basically. Well, once you're done, this voice over is still on, but there you go. So, now you see you have iOS 5. Um, so, here you got your newsstand, reminders and all the other features like messaging 
So, if you don't believe me that this is iOS 5 for some reason, um, I'll show you. So, right there, you can see I have version 5. Uh, so, yes, I do have i5 right now. So, congratulations. You have just activated iOS 5 without the actual activation. If you do want to start syncing it up to iTunes, uh, you will have to put your UDID code in a developer's account. Uh, like I said earlier, it's going to be 5 to 10 bucks. Um, if you have a friend, I'm sure he could do it. If you have a developer's account, you can do it. There you go. Uh, so all the features on iOS 5 will be coming in the future videos. So that was me, Commander Tech, showing you how to install iOS 5 and activate it without a developer's account. Uh, if you missed any steps or you want to go back and rewind the video or start at the beginning or just watch it a second time so you can do this with confidence, go ahead. Any more help or related videos, um, I'm sure I'll be posting uh, many, many more videos, not only about iOS 5, but other videos. Uh, feel free to subscribe to my channel. I'm Commander Tech. I'll see you in the next video. Commander Tech, signing out.